Joe, you'll never guess what we're going to be ranking today. Ooh, the best places to fall asleep? No. Hmm, maybe the best beds to fall asleep in? What? No. Hmm. How about the worst places to fall asleep? No, Joe. Today's tier list has nothing to do with sleeping. Classic Sleepy Joe. Could never get his mind off sleeping. Joe, we're ranking your second favorite thing, right behind sleeping. Oh, oh, I know. The best hair to sniff. What? Did you really just say that, Joseph? The hell is wrong with you, Joey? Well, we're ranking ice cream flavors today, oh not my God. no damn hair. Oh my God, ice cream, ice cream tier list. Yeah, yahoo, woo hoo, let's go. Come the hell down, Joe. I just can't believe it. We're finally doing it. It's ice cream time. Jesus, Joe. Ice cream time, ice cream my time. My God, I ice might cream just time. sit this ice one out time. if this old fool is gonna be like this for the whole damn Yay. tier list. Yay. That's it, I'm muting you, Joe. Cool it, Joey. Jeez, man. I knew he'd go crazy for an ice cream tier list, but I didn't know he'd go that crazy. Joe, I'm about to unmute you, but you better keep your composure. Ice cream, oh my God, ice cream. Shut up, Joe, I'm giving you one last chance. <sighs> icy creamy, icy creamy. Shut up before we make another Yo Halloween tier list. Wow, that actually shut him up. Yeah, I don't think Joe wants to ever do another Halloween tier list again after all the scares and Skeleton bullying, haha. Uh -huh. No more stupid scary tier lists, it's ice cream time. If you missed out on any of our Halloween themed tier lists last month, be sure to check out our playlist with all of them in the description below. Now let's start ranking these ice creams. Wait, wait. Before we start, did you guys make sure to put chocolate chocolate chip ice cream on the list? Yes, Joe, chocolate chocolate chip ice cream is on the list. Yes, yes, I'm ready. Jeez. Well, looks like we got the good old vanilla ice cream first. Thoughts on this one, boys? God tier. What? Yeah, put it on God tier. Why, Joe? You can't just say put it on God tier without telling us why. Because it's ice cream. Bruh, really? Just because it's ice cream? Be real, Joe. Matter of fact, all ice cream flavors should be placed on God tier. We're not putting all the damn ice creams on God tier. We're ranking these just like we do any other tier list. Fine. Uh, have it your way then. Vanilla should go into God tier anyways, though, because it's a classic. Oh, yeah, I love vanilla. It's such a simple and comforting flavor that never gets old. Vanilla is boring and fake news. You can't just call things you don't like fake news. That doesn't even make any sense. I can describe this ice cream however I like, Towers. Now throw this on mid-tier. Mid-tier? You're tripping, Donald. Vanilla is undoubtedly a classic. I'm putting it on the God tier, fellas. Yes. Next flavor we got is chocolate. What do you guys think? God tier. Bro, I just said we're not putting every ice cream on No, the... no, Joe has a point. Chocolate is definitely a God tier flavor. A point? What point? All he said is that it's God tier. Yeah, what more needs to be said? It's chocolate ice cream for crying out loud. Bro, tell us why you think it's God tier. Barack, there's something incredibly satisfying about the rich, velvety taste of chocolate that instantly puts my taste buds in heaven. It's God tier and real news. Real news? What does that mean? It means it's the real deal, Towers. Now put it on God tier. Whatever. You know what? I actually agree with y'all on this one. Like chocolate is a classic flavor you could never go wrong with. You definitely can never go wrong with a good chocolate ice cream cone, for sure. God tier it is then. Well, next we got strawberry ice cream. Ooh, I love strawberry ice cream. Even better is a strawberry milkshake. Mm. I can go for one right about now. Oh, if you guys haven't watched us rank fast food milkshakes, check that video out in the description. A milkshake does sound good right now. What do you guys like better, ice cream or a milkshake? Oh, definitely a milkshake. Nah, my favorite way to eat some ice cream is in a banana split. I feel like such a goofy goober every time I eat one. A goofy goober? Oh, are you talking about that time SpongeBob got wasted off of banana splits with Patrick? How the hell did SpongeBob and Patrick even get drunk off of ice cream? Man, I wish I could get drunk from ice cream. That would be a nightmare. You'd basically be drunk 24-7 with how much you eat ice cream. Oh yeah, that would definitely be terrible. But anyways, where should we place strawberry ice cream on the list? Well, it depends if it has those little bits of real strawberries in it, and it looks like this one does. Oh yeah, that for sure bumps it up a rank. Gonna go ahead and throw it on goaded tier because strawberry ice cream is a real hitter miss with it real quick if you're enjoying the video make sure you hit that like and subscribe button so you don't miss out on any of our future videos also let me know in the comments what your favorite ice cream flavor is all right the next flavor we got is rocky road Ooh, rocky road is so much fun there's a lot going on with this flavor i just love how those little marshmallows become soft and gooey in the ice cream it tastes so good i'm not big on rocky road it's a bit too chaotic in my opinion it's too much bro how is rocky road too much for you donald i'm a simple man and i enjoy simple flavors but we all already know you love this flavor with all the nuts it's got in it shut it donald you just always got to say something about me when there's nuts involved. I'm putting Rocky Road on the goaded tier since it's also such a classic. The next flavor we got is mint. Okay, I lied, guys. Not all these flavors are god tier. This shit's trash. Put it in awful. What? Why? Oh, I know why. This flavor's too damn spicy for me. That's actually insane, Joey. Haha. <laughs> There goes Joey with his weakling tongue again, but who the hell would want to eat an ice cream that tastes like 
toothpaste. This flavor does not taste like toothpaste, Donald. Okay, maybe sometimes, but it's such a different and refreshing flavor. Yeah, and those chocolate chip bits make this flavor all the more better. What's bracken, fellas? Oh, it's Bill. How you doing, Bill? Terrible. I'm doing terrible. Is that what you wanted to hear, Towers? Oh, damn, my bad, bro. Ah, shit. Bill's probably still recovering from that broken arm he got after tripping over a branch while we were at the Halloween Haunted Trails last month. Oh, how's your arm, Bill? My arm's fucked. The doctors had to chop that shit clean off to save my life because it got infected. Jesus, so you only got one arm now, Bill? Yeah, and I lost the lawsuit trying to sue the Halloween Trails company. Damn. Damn, bro. I told you. And now I'm bankrupt and lost all my money because of those damn lawyer fees. Damn. 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 Oh, and my wife left me. Damn. 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 Oh, I'm so sorry, Bill. Yeah, and that's not even the worst part about all this. What is it, Bill? I was halfway through playing Spider-Man 2 when I broke my goddamn arm. Now, how the fuck am I supposed to finish the game with just one arm? Tough luck, Bill. Maybe you should watch your step next time, pal. And maybe you should lose some weight, fat ass. <laughs> All right, somebody get this crippled old man off of Discord and back to his nursing home. We're the same age, dumbass. All right, enough arguing. We have an ice cream tier list to finish. An ice cream tier list? That sounds lame as hell. Why don't you all make a tier list of some bad bitches instead? No, ice cream is not lame. Take that back. Well, we're on mint chocolate chip right now. What do you think of mint, Bill? Uh, mint's a pretty fresh flavor, just like me. And mint's pretty chill, like me. Mint's pretty cool, like me. Okay, we get it, Bill. Put this shit on God tier, just like me. Shut it, Bill. Make me Cheeto man. Okay, okay. Next up, we got cookies and cream. Thoughts on this flavor? Ooh, cookies and cream is so good. It's like having two desserts in one. And I love the surprise of finding cookie pieces in each bite. Oh yeah, the smoothness of the ice cream and the crunch of the cookies is just an amazing combo. Cookies and cream is usually pretty good, but sometimes if the cookies aren't fresh, they lose their crunchiness and become soggy in the ice cream and it just ruins the texture. Yeah, and sometimes I might get a spoonful with lots of cookies. And the next one might have hardly any at all. I'm slapping this on the good tier, fellas. Before we move on to the next flavor, if you want to watch our videos first and early, then consider being a channel member. The hell is a channel member? Oh, you just get some really cool perks like watching our videos early and you also get these money badges next to your name along with these emotes to use in the comments. Along with these other bonus perks, if you're interested, then press the join button next to the sub button or in the description. The next flavor on the list is bubblegum. Now who the hell would want to eat bubblegum ice cream? Just go eat some real gum instead. Nah, for real, this one even has little bits of bubblegum in it too. Why would anyone want to chew some gum while eating some ice cream? This flavor's whack as hell, especially when them gum bits freeze up and become way too hard and feels like I'm crunching on ice cubes. Yeah, one time I broke a tooth in half while trying to chew those bubblegum bits. I'll never touch bubblegum ice cream again after that. Can't say I'm too fond of this flavor either. The bubblegum flavor always tastes way too artificial to me. This flavor belongs on awful tier. Agreed, I'm putting it on the awful tier. Butter pecan is next and this is such a great flavor. The rich buttery flavor combined with the crunchy toasted pecans is heavenly. It's like a comforting dessert hug in a bowl. Uh, this flavor reminds me of that one YNW Melly track called Butter Pecan. White cool butter pecan, big bitch Puerto Rican. What a banger, free Melly. No, keep that thug locked up. Yeah, didn't he murder his best friends or something? Innocent until proven guilty, fellas. You guys of all people should know that, especially you, Trump. Yeah, fuck all that. Free my slime on gang. Guys, what does slime mean? Get with the times, old man. I'm only three years older than you, man. Back to the butter pecan. It's a bit too heavy for my taste. It's almost like eating a stick of butter. I prefer lighter, fruitier flavors that don't leave me feeling too weighed down after. Of course you prefer fruity flavors, Barack. <laughs> this one has nuts in it though, Barry. Donald always says that you love nuts. <laughs> Joe, do not listen to Donald. I do not like nuts. Oh shit, is Barack a part of the LMNOP community? Hey. It's actually called the LGBTQQIP2SAA community. How the hell do you even remember the full thing, Joe? That's actually surprising that Joey can remember a long ass acronym like that. Can we just move on and rank this damn flavor already? I've got places to be. Where the hell do you have to be, Bill? I got a date with Kim Kardashian in 30, so let's wrap this shit up already. That's cap. That is fake news, Bill. Whatever, guys, I'm putting this flavor on goaded tier. Let's move on already. Yeah, I'm moving on from this whack ass Discord call. Later, losers. Jeez, why has Bill got to be so mean? Let him be, Joey. The man just lost an arm and a wife. He's going through a lot right now. Whatever. The next flavor is chocolate chocolate chip. Oh, Jesus. Chocolate chocolate chip. Put it on God tier. Jeez, Joey. What's so good about chocolate chocolate chip ice cream? Yeah, chocolate on chocolate just sounds like too much. That double chocolate is just a magical ice cream paradise. You wouldn't understand. 
Plus, I just love the TikTok edits those kids made about me and my chocolate chocolate chip. Mr. President, what did you order? Chocolate chocolate chip. Oh, yeah. Mr. President, what is your message to Republicans who are prepared to block the January 6th commission? Eat some chocolate chocolate chip. My TikTok edits are way better, Joe. Out of my fucking mind, mind. Wrong edit, study? wrong edit, hold on. Yeah, you can, you can get her out, get her out. You know, she looks just like Hillary Clinton, actually. Is that Hillary? Hillary, is that you? Yo, are you talking down on my wife, Donnie boy? Wait, didn't your wife leave you, Bill? Oh, right. Fuck that bitch. Well, where are we putting chocolate chocolate chip on the list, boys? I'm putting it on God tier. I don't care what you all say. Whatever, Joe. I'll let you have this one. What's the next flavor? It's chocolate chip cookie dough. I can't deny there's something nostalgic about chocolate chip cookie dough. It takes me back to being a kid making cookies with my grandma. I love cookies. The cookie dough combined with the soft crunch of the chocolate chips is just amazing. This flavor's pretty fire, but I've had it way too much and it just gets a little old after a while. But when you get that perfect bite, oh my God, it's like heaven in your mouth. The sweet, gooey cookie dough mixed with the creamy vanilla, it's ice cream heaven. I'm throwing this flavor on the goaded tier for now. And next up, we have rainbow sherbet ice cream. Ooh, sherbet is such a refreshing flavor on a hot day. It's like a burst of fruity coolness that just wakes up your taste buds. It's like summer in a bowl, and sometimes that's all you need. Obama and his fruity flavors, why don't you eat a real man's ice cream? What exactly is a real man's ice cream, Donald? The SpongeBob one you get from the ice cream trucks. Ice cream truck, where? Chill, Joey. There ain't no ice cream truck, and Donald, that's a popsicle, not a damn ice cream. Hey, it's close enough. Bruh, the Spider-Man one is better anyways. Nah, the Powerpuff Girl one is the best. Bruh, you know what? Maybe we should make an ice cream truck menu tier list one day. Let us know down in the comments if you guys want to see that. Ah, great idea, George. But what do you guys think about rainbow sherbet besides Donald? The problem with sherbet is that it's always too sweet or too tangy. There's never that perfect balance. One bite and I feel like I'm eating pure sugar. And the next, it's like I just bit into a lemon. It's all over the place. Yeah, chocolate chocolate chip is way better. This is like eating flavored ice. And I want my ice cream to be creamy and rich. I'll place it on the good tier because I will admit this flavor does hit the spot during the summer. Next, we got vanilla chocolate chip ice cream. I mean, vanilla chocolate chip is good, but it's kind of plain compared to some other flavors. It's like the safe choice when you're too scared to try something new. Yeah, and sometimes I wish there were more chocolate chips in there. It's like they're playing hide and seek in the vanilla and I'm losing. Vanilla chocolate chip is the OG comfort food. It's like having a warm hug in a bowl after a long day. I say it's God tier. Nah, man, I bet we've all had it a million times and it's just vanilla with some chocolate. That's it. I'm throwing it on good tier. Next up, we got birthday cake ice cream. Oh, this flavor makes me so happy. It feels like my birthday every time I eat it. Plus, those rainbow sprinkles are a game changer. Birthday cake ice cream is like a celebration in a cone. The cake batter flavor, sprinkles, and everything make it taste just like a real birthday cake. Nah, to me this doesn't taste like real cake at all. Yeah, and sometimes birthday cake can be a bit too sweet too. Like, I need a glass of water just to balance it out. Well, I'll just put it on the good tier then, since you guys aren't too fond of it. Cotton candy ice cream is next, and this one tastes like you're eating a unicorn. A unicorn? I don't know about that, but it is a great summertime treat, especially when you're looking for something sweet and refreshing. Although sometimes the sweetness can be a bit too much. That's exactly what I was gonna say, Barry. It's definitely not a flavor for those who prefer something more traditional and less sugary. This flavor is disgusting. Like I said with the bubblegum flavor, why not just eat some real cotton candy instead of this ice cream? Sometimes you just wanna have some different flavors rather than the same old ice cream, Donnie. This one is colorful and different and hits the spot on those hot days. I say, it's good tier at least, guys. Nah, the vibrant colors are fun, but the artificial flavor can be a bit overwhelming after a while. I'm putting it on the mid-tier. The next flavor is Neapolitan, another classic. It's like getting three flavors in one, and I can never decide between chocolate, vanilla, or strawberry. Oh yeah, you can't go wrong with Neapolitan. It's a crowd pleaser at any event because everyone can find their favorite flavor. I mean, it's a classic, but it's not the most exciting flavor out there. It's a safe bet when you can't decide, but it won't blow your mind. I love this flavor. The more flavors, the better. I can never get enough. Yeah, yeah, we know, Joe. We definitely know. Have you guys seen that video of Joey at a conference where he sees an ice cream truck and just leaves in the middle of a conference to get an ice cream? Uh, Mayor Bowser and Chancellor Farabee, you know, thank you for joining us as well. And for family- Classic Joe, always choosing ice cream over our great nation. 
This is why they need me in office. That chocolate chocolate chip was calling my name. I just couldn't help it. Whatever, Joseph, I'm placing Neapolitan on goaded tier. The next flavor is black cherry. What do you guys think of this one? Black cherry is a hidden gem. The rich, dark cherry flavor is a nice change from the usual fruit flavors, and it's super satisfying. I don't know. Sometimes black cherry can be a bit too tart for my liking. I'm not a fan of this flavor. Last time I had some, it tasted too artificial. Uh, I mean, it's great when it's done right, but not so much when it's not. This flavor is okay, but I'd much rather have any chocolate flavor over this. Man, y'all are just hating. Put some respect on black cherry. Sorry, Barry, most of the other flavors are just better than this one. I'm putting it on the mid-tier. Last but not least, we have vanilla caramel swirl ice cream. I'm all about that sweet and salty combo, and caramel swirl nails it. What's interesting about caramel swirl is that it has this rich velvety texture. The way the caramel blends with the creaminess of the ice cream is just so satisfying. This is a really good flavor, but I feel like it's missing something. I wish it had some chocolate chips or maybe some nuts, then it would hit just right. Yeah, this one's a bit basic for my liking. Caramel and ice cream is always good, but like Joey said, it's definitely missing something. I'm putting it on the good tier and we've done it. We finally made an ice cream tier list. I can't wait to make another one. Let us know in the comments if you guys want us to rank ice cream truck menu ice creams next. Now it's time for member shout outs. Shout out to ZZ, Mr. Fatty Tyrone, Gage Cordic, Ponce, OMJ, Arapentitos y Convertidos, Zarka, Kane Gutierrez 1, Droids 115, Epic Blebit, Hunter Thompson, Lil Fish, Obama Rama, Jaguar Stonepaw, The Mo Mechanic, Lil Boom, Joshua O'Malley, Bird Calover 22, your average Dragon Ball Z fan, Chen Yu, Ether, Captain Skull 866, Anthony VAVR, Nikolai FR, Money Dynamic, Matanya, Otto von Bismarck, Star Brother, I'm a cool 148, Bandit, Bradley Bowden, Sox, Connor the Gamer, A Normal Green Slime, Melanie Elrod, Archangel 98, Bloody Red, and Mr. Oddball for being our fantastic channel members. More shout outs to Gaming Dragon, Quickscope Cooper, Prince Fearless Eagle, Animations Guy, Winter, SRF, Nostalgia Network, Bunny Garden, Firefly, Hamster World, Smelly Boomer, Some Random Guy, Brandon Ayala, Amper Sandler, Lof Mohizamaz, and Omnilude for being the best channel members. Even more shout outs to Gabe Dudas too, Alpha Diamond, Joe V, 1998, Ballsack, Kirby Gamer, Dominic Comis, Jabaro 19, Flapjack Enjoyer, Thomas Hilberg, V Ricochet, The Warpath, Deontay McGee, Mevins 2001, Mark Fabian Moans, Jordan Arnest, Jolteon, 1864. Finn Akers for supporting us even further. I love you. And finally, shout outs to the Gilder, 7111, Makoto 13, Media Fan 50, Defender of Communism, Adamantium Asari, Spectre, and finally, Alex Ovando.